Hey guys, so whenever a king would overtake a land, um, and so basically the king, you know, came in and he overthrew whoever was in charge, he would send out what's called a herald. And this herald would go through and announce the good news, the good news about the new king. And, and basically this good news would spread and the herald would go through and he'd yell, you know, and scream that the, there was a new king and that there was peace that came. And this is really cool because whenever Jesus shows up on the scene, we see these angels that are going out. And this is where we get this from uh, Christmas songs, Hark the Herald Angel Sings, because these heralds are going out and they are announcing something peace to those whose his favor rest right uh, so it, it's the beginning of the good news it's the beginning of the fact that the, the, there is a change in the command of things and we see that jesus is announced as overtaking his king just whenever he arrives on the scene and um it's also i mean you got to think that there was a war right that you couldn't have had a king come and overthrow another king without a war and there's been a war and all of a sudden when jesus shows up it's peace and goodwill towards man so this divide that is between man and god all of a sudden with the birth of jesus is beginning to mend and so there's a peace there there's now now you know like there's a work right and so everything in creation up to this point has been getting us to this point and when jesus shows up is whenever god is making the reparations on his side right i know there's a lot of preparation you can see what god was doing all throughout the old testament but at that moment the war stops right and god is making his preparations or his reparations right he's making this right he's doing his part and it says that you know like on whoever his favor rest right? And his favor rests on whoever responds to his reparations. Jesus comes and he takes our place and he, you know, like God pretty, God makes this whole sacrifice for us. And, you know, he is the herald one. He's the one that's, you know, they're talking about, hey, peace and goodwill for those his favor rest on. And that favor is going to rest on those that come from the other side, right? If we have a divided area, those that come from the other side and reach back and they take in and allow this new king to be the king. Those are the ones that this reparation is allowed to happen to. So guys, I just want to encourage you. God made Jesus Lord and Savior. So whenever it comes down to it, whenever it says, you know, peace for those that, that you know, his favor rests, You've got to make him Lord. You cannot be your own king anymore. You can't be the king of your own life. You can't be, you know, the, the one that, that is in control of everything. We've got to learn to let go. So, thanks for taking a minute.